I'm I'm gonna be honest with you. As I drink a yogurt drink, I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys. Uh, Hollow Hardcore is kind of kind of soul draining in the sense that you can uh you can put in like 50 hours of work and then just like that have have the whole world disappear on you, right? You can you can just you can just have the whole world vanish in an instant. So. I'm uh, I'm doing something that's a little more permanent now. I guess I guess um I guess Tales of Kalistria is also something that's kind of permanent. Sorry, yogurt drink, but um I also kind of want to play single player, just regular ass single player survival Minecraft. So just just survival, hard difficulty, uh, no cheats, world seed blank. We could do we could do large biomes. We could do amplified. Honestly, we could even do single biome, but you know default. Default seems the way. Actually, I'm very. I'm actually kind of tempted to hit amplified. You know, just just let me let me see what 1.20 can do. Yo, Doctor Quantum, you have you have you. How are you, my favorite streamer? I actually have no idea. Uh, maybe you maybe you just don't know any other good ones. I guess. Anyways, uh, oh wait, sorry. How are you, my favorite streamer? Sorry, I thought you were asking like, how am I your favorite? Okay, thanks, Doc. But uh, I'm I'm. I'm actually very, very tempted to hit Amplified. Just, just make this shit even, even crazier. But I mean, this is this is a mm, fuck it. We'll coin toss. We'll coin toss for it. on heads. Uh, on heads, we will do a. Hold on, let me just check the non-sensitive tab open. A uh, bunch of 4chan tabs. Uh, yeah, no, this, this is this is fair enough. We can we can. We can toss for it, okay? On on heads, uh, no, actually, do we do oh, on tails? On tails, we will do amplified. On heads, we will do conventional, okay? It's preparing to flip. Is it preparing to flip? Is the coin flipping? Heads! Okay. Uh, well then, conventional world it is. Let me very quickly tab back over to Minecraft. Done. Amplified would have been fun, but honestly, like, you can, you can, you can make, you can make cool shit in any kind of survival world. So, no, not large biomes, uh, single biome. Wait, oh, no, 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 default. Generate structures, yes. Bonus chests, no more options. Game rules. We're gonna have all of these set to default. Um, I would really like to spawn have have spawn phantoms turned off, but uh, I would I would really like to I would really like to you know get get deal with. No phantoms, but fuck it. Let's just let's try world. So this series might be a long time. so I I already have a notepad in front of me. If this series probably will be a long standing thing. I have a notepad in front of me and a pen. In the event I need to take any conclusions, any places like new reader, stuff like that. And because we're generated in one point when we can have access to a bunch of things that are very hard to find in Andrea, we will have access to sniff eggs. But access to archaeological materials, um, camels, all that shit, and all the shit we have for the versions. Let me very quickly chug this ambrosial, heat treated ferment, Greek style flavored yogurt, heat treated fermented milk drink. That is a mouthful. Like drinking, it's like drink pure yogurt melted ice cream. Sense one of it being yogurt drink. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. All right, that's a mouthful. Yeah, that, that is a mouthful, buddy. Okay. 
now that I'm all yogurt it up, I already see a couple of interesting things. So, we are in a basic bitch planes biome. That's okay. Let me just write down world spawn 24. Oh, sorry, my bad. We're in a flower forest. 24 slash 71 slash negative 51. In the event that we stay in this world long enough to warrant getting... Oh, wait, hold on. Are my game sounds turned off? Yeah, they are. Okay, in the event that we stay in this world long enough to warrant, say, building, like, a farm that, you know, grabs all of our spawn chunks, or that requires our spawn chunks to be built in, we can, uh... We can take pretty good advantage of this. The fact that there is a flower forest that spawn. Now, I'm just going to grab all of the two high ones. Oh, wow, there's quite a few two high blocks. Uh, and also pumpkins, which are going to be good for golems and the hired help achievement. We just, yeah, day one, day, one of, day one of the series and I go flower picking. Okay, we have rose bushes and lilacs, which are the two, the two big ones. Also, I think I should press... Yeah, I should just write down bracket overworld and then write below, I'll write an up arrow and then I'll write flower forest because this is a one, a good place to get bees, two, a good place to uh, get flowers, three, um, oh, that is, that is a village, wow, for a random seed, this is a pretty good spawn. That's the seed, by the way. It's minus 55, 95, 71, 24, 34, 81, 35, 36, 2, 1, 5. Yeah, that's, that's mouthful. Absolute mouthful. But that's okay. We have, we have a village, which means we're probably actually off to a good-ish start. We can get everything, everything loaded pretty quickly. Uh... So the new meta for getting like mass amounts of wood in 1.20 is bamboo. Uh, I don't see any bamboo anywhere near here, which is unfortunate, but we can probably figure shit out as we go. So let me just grab a wooden axe, and as long as there are more than three sheep with this plane, we should be good. I hope. Uh, I see one sheep. Oh, yeah, more than, more than. Plenty. Oh wow, and it's kind of a big village too. Okay, I'm really sorry. I'm, yeah, I, I sort of, I sort of, I could have stole, I could just go steal a bed. But at the same time, you know, planes biome, they're very plentiful. There's at least two here. And honestly, we could probably afford to get an animal pen going day one. And then we can have a, uh, gonna need to do something about that cave. I died in that village long term. Uh, we can we can very easily get a little bit of speedy progress if we will co cooperate. Uh, okay, brewing stand. Ignore them, you know, just into a religious building and started stealing their floor. This is um this is this is completely necessary. The, these acts of blasphemy are completely required. And I'm just going to get myself enough to maybe make a furnace, steal all of the cool stuff they have, and then run. Because villagers are great, and I like to keep them great by not staying inside them and causing like a jillion fucking zombies to spawn. And then, you know, having to fight off the zombie apocalypse. I can come back when we have a bunch more stuff. And then when we have a bunch more stuff, we can... Basically, shop the village's natural defenses, uh, protect it, you know. Die, I did not grab the stone I needed to make a furnace. On the upside, there's probably... I'm, I'm probably just going to keep the cobblestone, because there are probably things in this village that could make a furnace. Oh my god, sorry. My nose is, my nose is getting blocked. I think I, I think I caught something from a friend in camp. So, I might have caught, like, some... some I, I don't know if it's COVID. It feel like COVID, but it, I, I, I really don't think it's COVID, but it feels like, it just feels like some unnamed, like, like, just, just the flu, just the fucking flu. Anyways, you know what, I could probably, 
no, that was not what I wanted to do, but at least we're beautifying the world a little bit. Place crafting table, make a hoe, grab a hoe, break the table, start hoeing this shit up. And I'm very tempted to try ocean travel to just like you know just see how much see much see how much of the world there is. Just you know, start putting out feelers basically if if I am a Tyranid, I would I would send out like a high fleet, you know, just some feelers. Get some feelers in the water. Also, wow, I thought black cats were only supposed to spawn in sub in in um no sorry not savannas uh witch huts, but that that looks like a black cat. Huh? I guess they changed that. Also, is that just weirdly shaped land or is that trail ruin? I uh also oh, sure. acacia wood. That's kind of cool, I guess. If you're into, you know, acacia, one, two, three, four, five. Let's make like forty. Let's let's, let's make eighteen bread. My bad. Uh, put this down here. I'll just remember. The okay, hold on. Let me just also write spawn village. That's uh, one seventy nine slash sixty two slash negative one thirty bracket overworld, and then I guess we'll just travel fucking north. I don't know. Yeah, let's go north. Yeah. So, we might, oh, if that is a shipwreck, oh, whoa, Jesus Christ! There's an ocean monument. Is that? Oh my God, that ocean. Going to be within spawn chunks, which is absolutely crazy. I don't think, I don't think I've ever seen that happen. Uh, what I have seen happen is going to a shipwreck and basically away to diamonds. So swim down. I, was, I went completely through the ship. That's a uh, moss. Okay. You know what? Let me just. just Everything. I'm at the stage of the game where everything is useful to me. Okay, swim up, swim up, swim, swim up. That drowning, that drowning damage actually hit really, really fast. Now let's see. Is there? Yes, there we go. Hey, there should not be any other treasure aboard the ship. Uh, you know what, I, I kind of don't want to get greedy, but at the same time, I do kind of want to go back down and check that one room. Let's just see very quickly. Is there anything of note here? Yes, there is! I got a bunch of iron. Okay. Don't, don't get a stupid first death, don't get a stupid first death, don't get a stupid first death. Okay. Breach the surface. And now, we begin... Looking for the buried treasure. It's due south of us, okay. Oh, basically like straight ahead. Well, we are, we are having an oddly productive first episode. I'm not used to, I'm not used to doing work this good. Okay. It's that way, that island over there. I might need to upgrade this to a chest boat, actually. Okay, you know what? Hold on. Swim. Swim over it. Swim vaguely over it. F3. I need to head to block... Uh, need to head to block... 9-9. This is the block. There we go. And the stuff here is not actually all that good. Hold on. You know what? Let me just... Do that. Uh, the 
Okay, the diamond's are actually going to be pretty useful. The leather tunic is actually also going to be kind of useful. Uh, one of the items down here was a chest. There we go. Which means I can take the chest. And I can take my chest boat. Hold on. Wait, is that a... Okay, sorry, I saw the weird thing and I was like, is that a shipwreck? There you go. Oak boat with chest. Put the oak boat with chest here. Dump a bunch of shit into oak boat with chest. But actually, you know what? Now that I have a little bit of iron, I should actually... I say actually a lot, I realize. I should actually begin using the iron. You know, just... Just, just in... In the interest of keeping myself alive. So, is there any wood here? There's not enough to make a shield. Okay, let's very quickly fix this. And let's do one, two, iron pick. Iron axe, iron shovel. Those feel like two things that are pretty important. At least, at least for early game adventuring. Now, I have a chest plate, which means we can probably afford to do uh, leggings and leggings and um, the, 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 the food, the, the foot, the foot. We can afford to do the foot, everyone. I love, I love when you play early Minecraft and it's just like achievement after achievement. It's like you start going crazy on those achievements. Okay. Um, before I depart, I am going to want at least one sapling in the event that I wind up on some deserted island that actually would make a really good base location if not for the fact that it has no trees. So, you know, that's, that's just one of my sensible concerns. One of the few sensible concerns that I have. Uh, oh god, I really think I'm feeling sick. I might need to go see a doctor tomorrow. Okay, oak sapling, there we go, easy as. And I guess the main goal to get situated is bamboo, because bamboo is now is now the go-to wood. It Bamboo is the thing that everyone needs. Okay, so let's F5, and then let's F3. So we already have five armor bars, which is quite nice. Uh... I just write Ocean Mon at Spawn Village. There we go. And honestly, this is a pretty good day one start. We could have crafted a diamond sword, but I think it makes more sense to save at least two at least two of those in an enchant table because two diamonds make an enchant table. An enchantment is probably a bigger from iron sword to diamond sword. So what what my plan is is we take those two diamonds, we find some we find four orbs, we find books that we have here, and that is already most of the way to an enchantment table. That's the hard part of an enchantment set. The hard part is just cow's leather time. Cow's leather and time waiting. I keep forgetting that squid are different colors in, in spec. So yeah, really, really fun. A really, really good start, rather. I realize the more I play Minecraft, it's how good the start is really does not matter that much, you know. As long as like you can, you can be fortunate early on you have a really good start, or you have a terrible, absolutely terrible start, like worst speedrunner start imaginable. But you know, there's there's it's an infinite world, it's a near infinite world, and your success is what you make of it. I mean, we have a good diamonds within. Twits. So, um, and we are now straining my, my cursor. See how much we can discover. Uh, this th there's there's a lot of friction. This is if, if I was in I was in a better spirit, I'd be you know traveling across the ocean, seeing the wonky theme. Also, uh, speaking not not. Technically related to Hollow Hard, 
I'm thinking, I put season 13 like a few days before 1.20 dropped, and I might just cancel the current season 13, like season 13, the, the first season 13 world, the world that never was, and then I might just start a new one in 120. I guess, I guess would be, oh, hey, hey another ocean monument. Uh, uh, hold on. Ocean Mon. That makes two, two six five six two slash negative team eighteen bracket over. Oh, sorry, I am getting a voice call. This this might be important. I am terribly sorry, I just got a call from my grandmother, and we, she's, she's a, yeah, that was, that was uh, basically her just asking for a quick life, but then she got a call, so she might be offline for, so yeah, also, that is a nice biome. What's, what is this? Play. Cold ocean, okay. That's right, like frozen ocean, frozen ocean, right? Hold on. There you go. I know Minecraft biomes. Uh, let me just write. Frozen ocean. Two hundred fifty-eight slash C two slash negative fourteen ninety-eight bracket overworld. There we go. Uh, this is a good place to come in if I ever need a bunch of ice. You know, just, just loot an entire frozen ocean. And with that, we are going to keep on our travels. I'm thinking this might be, this might just be another comically long adventure where we travel breadth of 
the world and then settle someplace. Oh, and how about the one tree, the one tree island as a... Oh! You know what, there's a spruce place. That's kind of cool. Uh, no pun intended. Uh, uh, I'm not really in the mood to settle down in a spruce biome. It's, it's one of my... Oh, hold on. Grandma's calling again.
Gotta get back to my streaming. Yeah, puppy midstream. Yeah. I am sorry if anyone is still watching after that. My grandmother called me and we. Oh well, it was, it was like a 10, 10, 20 minute call. So sorry, it's not a 10 minute call. That's. It's fair to say that was a 10 minute call. And uh, we had a. Uh, we discussed plans to, to meet up. And that was my. Uh, yeah, that was. That was. That was. That was the. Uh, cause of the hold up. How, how many frames am I? 18 frames a second, of course. That's. You know, the hollow. <laughs> hollow hardcore experience. <laughs> Except this is hollow hardcore. The hollow heart YT experience. Um. I have one main goal for today's for today's stream. It's find a jungle biome, which I'm probably not going to do. I have through cold areas like this, but I should maybe just hug the skirt of this landmass in the event that I find something you know vaguely jungle temperatured. I will I'll follow that. And uh, yeah, long 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 talk, long chat. Oh, turtles. I still remember coordinates these are. I just write turtle beach. Okay, then 500 slash 62 negative 2005 bracket overworld. So, I, I think I'd like sakura trees because, you know, they're, they're pretty, pretty cool. I would also like jungle, so I might have a lot of exploring out for me. Uh, might might have a bit of an exploring cut out for me. And I also believe what I just saw was a oh sorry that's that's a swamp. But I believe I saw a shrek. So what is? Oh oh that's pretty cool. I keep forgetting quids give out a light value because of optifine. It's it's pretty cool having like a living light source. I was, I was gonna say, did I see a shipwreck anywhere down here, or was that just like weird weird terrain gen? Uh, I'm afraid that might have just been weird terrain gen. Okay. 
Well, there's a swamp, which is, I guess, worth putting because swamp be used to make some farm. You just, uh, also, witch farms, actually. Witch farms are also kind of, well, uh, witch farms are also kind of goaded. But, uh, a little bit of a pain ass to make, because if you want the best witch farms, the witch farms that will outperform raid farms, what you are going to have to do is make a perimeter. And, I mean, you you, you, guys, you guys watch Hollow Hunt, but you know that I just spent so fucking long making a perimeter that is probably not even as big as a perimeter for this one would be. Also, this is a huge frozen ocean. A huge, huge frozen ocean. Okay, um... Let me come through here real quick. Is that, is that just the regular rock generation, or is that a trail ruin? Is that a trail ruin? Hold on. F3, uh, Swamp plus Big Tiger. Five ninety nine slash sixty two slash negative two four six nine. Uh, let me just very quickly see. Whoops. F5. I hit like I hit like four things trying to hit F5. Oh no, it's just just weirdly shaped, weirdly shaped terrain. That's my that's my B. Okay, now that is that is big big frozen ocean, very big frozen ocean, very very big frozen ocean. Let's let's go let's go see what that frozen ocean's about. I feel like now that chest boats are a thing, hopper boats should be the next thing. You know, agree with me or not? That's the feel like feel like they should be the little step. This big frozen ocean, I guess. What what do we it's not called anything different, right? It's just it's just called ocean. That, that 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 um those ice spikes are fucking huge. They are big, big old big uns. And uh, yeah, let's keep let's keep traveling. Still fun, which is cool. Uh That is a... can't tell if this is a Long Beach, which is probably, I think, that is in California. Or if this is transitioning into a desert, okay. Is this transitioning into a desert, though? I cannot tell. Huh. Really be sure on this, on this account. Let's quickly mark the, the coordinates of this as, uh, let's go here. That's F3, and then let's write Lush Cave, L-U-S-H-C-A-V-E, 688 slash 62 slash negative 2775. Oh, multiple Lush Caves, I guess. That would be a good place if I ever want. Glowberries? M moss? I, you know, here's the thing, moss can be farmed at an incredible rate, so if I ever find myself undertaking a mega project and I'm like, huh, how do I get 150,000 moss? I'm not going to be like, ah, lush cave. I'm going to be like, well, time to build time to build this, this modular moss farm six times over, you know? So, I have found... Something that is potentially interesting. Break this, get the gold, swim over here, don't take damage, take the damage. Uh, and do I see a chest anywhere around here? Do I see a chest? Chesty, chesty, chest. Is that a chest? No, that's an obsidian. Uh, oh, wait, there it is. Chest. I missed it. Okay, take all, all this. Swim out. These are not good. These are not. This is not good chest loot. Okay. Uh. I might need to use the bathroom real. Quick. Imagine getting interrupted twice in an, in in forty minutes of streaming.
Okay, yeah, gotta use the, gotta use the bathroom. I'll be back in a little bit.
Okay, I am back. Uh, 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 enough interruptions. Uh, uh, um, it's been going 51 minutes, oh god. Yeah, let's... Let's try and make the best of what time we have left, or, you know what, let's not, let's not play it by time we have left. Let's just go for like three hours and see if I can find a jungle by him. Is that a jungle by him? No, it's a no tiger. I might get entry time I get before I buy him, before I get all the shit. Uh, but, you know what, I guess one of the things I should be endeavoring to do in this world is to get all achievements, so that works. That was quite nicely, actually. Let's say, I asked, I, hmm. So, let's just, let's just go. Let's just, let's just travel. I'm gonna travel until I hit a point where I can't travel by ocean anymore. And then once that happens, we'll figure something else out. The ocean, the ocean. The oceans are vast. You know, I still, I still vaguely remember when I started playing in 1.7. Uh, just like, just how fucking huge the back then. Uh, I felt like insanely, the oceans felt insanely huge, and I'm wondering if. Okay, that's just a piece of sandstone. Is that just a piece of sandstone? It's got me second guessing myself. Oh, it's above ground. Uh, yeah, I guess it is just a piece of sandstone. Oh well, I remember point four point seven. Those those oceans were friggin' insane. Those 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 were the days, man. Those those were the days. Me kind of want to do a series where I just go back to one point four point seven and screw around on it. Probably wouldn't do well commercially, or well, co commercially, I say that as if I'm making any money off this. Probably won't do that well viewer-wise, but it will... Probably will do okay in terms of, like, longevity. And then we can, we can, we can advance the series as, as time goes on. You know, every time one Minecraft update happens, we can update we can update the series by like two versions. I don't know. That makes that 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 makes sense. Oh, that sounds fair. A lot of a lot of hiccups we're running into. Got it. Single player, him regular survival world. Play selected world. Taking a little while to get in, but we should have. There we go. We are in. That's a buried treasure map that is different from the one we had before, which is nice. Uh, there should be some shit inside this lovely, lovely shipwreck. It's a. Uh, and let's try the- Oh wait, hold on, that's bamboo! That's bamboo, our quest is over, we don't need to travel any further. Because we have three pieces of bamboo, and three pieces of bamboo can very quickly turn into about half a million pieces of bamboo. And if you think that is exaggerating, uh, it is not. Oh wait, hold on. It's, it's it's really not that big of an exaggeration. I'm I'm not I'm not I'm not I'm not over exaggerating by that much. It is bamboo is bamboo is like a plague. 
Except it's a plague that's useful to me, so I, I don't have a problem with it. Okay. Oh! Armor trims. Nice, nice, nice. I just very quickly gra grab all of these. I'm going to drown. I'm going to drown to death. Whoa. Okay. Thank God this was such a shallow, shallow one because that, that, oh, I literally have a potion of water breathing in my inventory. You know, shit hit the fan. I could have just chugged that and I'd be safe. Uh, that was, that was, that was silly. Well, now that we've achieved our, our sole goal for the episode, which is to, uh, which is to, uh, get, get bamboo, I guess, I guess the world's my oyster. If I want, I could go hunt down a mushroom biome or something. I could also put an armor trim on, like, one piece of my gear, which is probably a terrible, terrible financial investment. But at the same time, I think it'd be pretty cool to just put, like, coast. And then I put, like, a lapis. So I get this, this like, blue trim. Okay, this looks way, way better in the default texture pack. Uh, resource packs. This would look a lot better if I was using all of the default textures, and... Come on, prove my point, please. Prove my point. I kind of need... I kind of need this to prove my point. <sighs> this is... this is... this is going to embarrass me. It's gonna crash and then we're gonna have a no whole nother debacle. Oh, wait, no. No. Yeah, see, the blue... the blue... the blue band actually looks pretty decent. Now, if I want to be able to dupe like a shitload more of these, I'm going to need like seven diamonds per trim. Which is kind of a crazy amount. Now that I'm no longer using a resource pack that is a hundred bits, I can probably afford to ooh, dark forest. I can afford to go a little bit a little bit grander. Uh, you know what? I might just I'm 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 not gonna I'm probably not gonna base here, but dark forest is a type. Well, this is a type of wood, and it would be kind of cool to swim up here, drop F three, and then be like dark oak forest. At 733 slash 62 slash negative 3043. Yeah, this, this, this works. This could work just fine. And I might just travel through this river. So I might. So here's, here's, here's a bunch of things I'm considering, right? I like high pla I, I like places that are either incredibly high or low. So, knowing that about me, my options are huge mountain castle, huge, huge mountain base. Uh, okay, so no, no, no. I, I, I'm sorry. I like places that are incredibly high, incredibly low, incredibly isolated from others. So, my options are, you know, deep, like massive cave base, like massive underground area base, a massive, like, mountain castle, or we do, like, something like a, like a fortified island, like one whole island Dizzle. And those those are basically my options as far as as far as these locations go. But uh, yeah, I'm thinking I'm thinking a mushroom island is probably probably baller idea for base. Except mushroom islands are as you, as as most Minecraft players know quite hard to find. Also, wait is is this whole thing one one contained island? If I use a map, am I going that this is one big island? Oh my god, I think it is. Okay, uh... Well, this 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 island isn't that separated from the land. It's kind of just like a... Like a little island spit of land. But I am also going to mark them as... Um... 
Coastal Island? Yeah, Coastal Island. Nine seventy one slash sixty two slash negative three seven seventy one. Okay, and now that we know where that is, we might as well just keep up the travel. I I think Mushroom Island would be cool. Uh, I like not having to do with mobs spawning in my base in and around my base. But uh, yeah, also do if I want to do like a antisocial base, right? Like like basically a to access like impregnable area. That like no pillager raid could ever come close. I might consider some sort of high mountain that overlooks the ocean, because that is because the ocean will protect my base from one side, and yeah, you know, that, that one side of protection might be quite valuable. Yeah, get the traveling, 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 traveling. That's a ruin another portal. Probably got stuff worth grabbing. Oh wait, is yes. a big, deep, dark underground area. Uh, nope, just just kind of a weird. Oh wow, this is kind of a weird shaped cave. Hold on, is, is the, no? I'm ignoring you. I'm ignoring you both. Oh, wow. See, that's interesting, but it's not all that big, you know. I I could I could be larger. Okay, conventional gapple, mans, uh, three items that have mending on them plus four items that have mending on them is, you know, probably a coincident, probably like the the odds against this happening are like astronomical. But at the same time, uh, don't really use golden pants. For about I don't know about you guys, but, but I have golden pants. I'm uh, I'm also not gonna grab that piece of gold because, I mean, well, first, first, okay, first things first. I am lazy. I'm a lazy piece of shit. I'm a lazy little piece of shit. Second thing, second, it's uh, it's thorns. Thorns on gold is a recipe to have your armor broken by the first thing like four times in a row. That's 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 mainly it. Anyways, I'm gonna travel to about a thousand. Yeah, about about a, about a thousand on the x-axis, and then I'm just going to skim along back towards. That seems that seems logical, right? And uh, yeah, is that a shroom island? No, but is it? A, if it's if it's a, it doesn't need to be a shroom island per se. It just needs to be like a quaint little island. Uh, I can see living in brown sheep. That's cool. Uh, brown sheep is not what we're looking for. And this looks to be largely connected to some sort of mainland. Yep, that's that would be a no for me, dog. Oh, but if there's a desert, I might grab a couple cactus. Uh, cactus always useful to have. This is a desert. Nope, just a big beach. Hmm. Uh, no, 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 no. Turning nighttime again. Oh, that's another village. Man, it feels like it all comes back to Plains villages, you know. I think I go. It all comes back to the same, like, the same general type of type of structure. Plains villages. Still can't do anything with Fletcher tables, which is. You know, saddening. Oh, actually, hold on. Are there chickens? Are we good to, might, might be good. A couple of chickens, put them in a hole, and then just start gathering, like, eggs. But, hold on. Actually, let's quickly write this. Let me write down Chicken Town 1509 69 giggity slash Next 3090. Yeah, as you guys can see, we are out of looping to a spawn. Yeah. It's a thing. Uh, 
Oh, let's let's loop let's loop back to this is like in the general direction of space. If we don't find the don't find a mushroom biome, we don't find a mushroom biome. That's simply simply all that is. Also, I just grab kelp so that I don't need to take a dedicated ocean trip at some point in the future because there's like a good gin kelp. Because like a few a few pieces of kelp can make like a gajillion kelp. Love these love these numbers. Love these like SI units that I've just been inventing on. Second, let me just very quickly open a bottle of coke. As we've been seeing on the shelf for like half a year. Don't ask. Oh. oh this is not making my block nose and, and sore scratchy throat get any better. small island. Is this just, just is there just like one tiny little island in the middle? Oh no, this this looks like land. Yep. Look like land. Really? Oh, hello, Zolex. Welcome to the stream. I uh, don't really know. I'm planning to go. So, uh, I have a general idea of like just just mushroom island. You know, do a do a conversion, convert it to grass, and maybe with a go with like a green castle aesthetic, which is which is weird until you remember how many green blocks we have to work with. We can work with, we can work with leaves. We can work with concrete, uh, emerald. Uh, we can work with basically all of the prismarine fits with the teal aesthetic. That's uh, a lot of options that we have. Do I have pumpkins? Yeah, we have pumpkins. Uh, we have a lot of options. We just don't have the means at the moment. Yeah, we got a, we got a lot of plans, but we don't have a lot of power to carry out plans. If that makes any sense. Uh, is this going to be the one that has a gapple in it? Going that's good food. Uh, oh, Fortune 2 might be almost worth grabbing. Yeah, Fortune 2. Sure. Clock, I'll take that. And since it's readily accessible, I might as well just grab this gold. Uh, in the cosmic scheme of things, which is to say, in, in, this, in the scheme of a Minecraft world that goes for a very long time, doesn't mean that much. Once you, once you have enough apples, or once you are like resistant enough to damage, that you probably won't need to drop an emergency gapple. It's uh, they, they don't mean a they mean a huge amount, but that's still kind of useful. Anyways, ooh, oh this this is interesting terrain. I tell you what, okay, find a mountain that goes above one sixty. Quickly. We're just claiming it and building a base there. In the meantime, we will just travel by ocean. We will just ocean travel our way around. Uh, but... But this mountain does not look all that big. Uh... Yeah, it's not all huge. This is a well, this is a mild disappointment. Uh, hmm. 
No, hey, more iron. I guess that's more, more goodies that are readily available to us. I'm gonna laugh if I travel all over the world like this. And eventually, wind up basing like 400 blocks from spawn. That would be, that would be comically funny, but also heartbreaking. Oh wow! Hold on, hold on, hold on. Did not see that. Did not see that. It did not render in. I have the stuff I need to make the boots. Uh, I have the stuff I need to kill cows, but hold on, hold, hold, hold your horses. F3, we're at 81. This gentleman, gentleman, this, uh, this, this place might be it. This place might actually be it. It might be, might be that biome. Let me just, uh, hold on. I have a shovel ready in the event that I fall into powdered snow and need to, need to unfuck myself. Uh, okay, this regular us. F3, this is 98. We might be onto something here. Frozen peaks. Also, I've never based in a frozen peaks before. I know it's probably going to get snow on a lot of the things I love, but I mean, we can, we can, we can, we can, un we can cover, we can break, snow. we can put down top. Uh, how high is this? How tall is the point? It's at 124, so about 40 blocks short of what I think a high mountain is. I know I just got to 200 now, but this is a very nice place. Uh, it's a very nice place surrounded by other very nice things. You've got a got a big plains, you could build so much there. What look like what looks like a singular meadows biome. You have a what I think is a river gorge, like the, like there's a river that works its way through the terrain. You are surrounded by spruce forests, uh, blue ice. That that uh, that that ruins the seeding value of the place a little. The, the fact that there's the fact that there's a big section of the forest just caught a flame, kind of kind of ruins the cinematic value a little bit. But this is a very cool place. I'm gonna write down frozen peaks. Frozen peaks at 1745 slash 129 slash negative 3211. So um yeah, let me just make my way, make my ass, make my let me let make the make let me make my slow ass way down the mountain. That did not that did not create that did create water. Okay, I'm just gonna follow this water down. All the way. That's the water on myself, so. Also, the water, the water will break powdered snow in my path down. So if there's any powdered snow, I'm, 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 I'm gonna get caught by it. Oh, my nose, my nose. I don't know if you can hear it in my voice, but my nose is getting steadily more congested, which is. Making me sound you know, steadily, steadily, steadily worse. Oh well. Uh, yeah. if, we can't, if we can't, we don't find an, a mushroom biome. We just reserve. We might just reserve the right, like not build a permanent base yet. And then we find. A mushroom biome that suits our tastes. We we build up a perman permanent base there. That a very tall mountain. You know what? This is a very scenic area. I'm hoping those mountains are nice and high. Do they? Do they nice and high? I like the I like the curve like explan. It's like 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 an anvil rising, like a half buried anvil. But this does not go nearly high enough. Uh, near high enough. It's also got a cave on that's full of like t t mooglies. <laughs> like oogly mooglies. Uh, well, we can keep going. Go with it. 
as more iron, which is very nice. Always a nice thing to have. Let me just very quickly dump all of the extra stuff that can fit up here, up there. And then let's get back to sea travel. That's a big floating rock. Huh. Huge going on. Back Back to our home. These are all kind of tallish areas, but none of them are really what I am looking for, you know? I didn't... I, I didn't vote. I don't my bed lying around somewhere. Well, that's, that's stupid. Uh, but fortunately, I have the things I need to make another, so... Break this. Bed. Bed. There's a drowned approaching. There's a drowned that is slowly approaching me. He. There's a drowned in my boat. Glorious. Um. And house chooses his time to stop working. This. This is this is amazing, by the way. Uh. Wake up before the drown get me. Okay. Oh, just sitting in there. Thank God there was I didn't drown back then. If there were, I'd be dead as dicks. Like, like actually dead dicks right now. Oh, apparently I've never gotten Monster Hunter before. Learn something new every day, I guess. Uh, let's keep them. There's this like big river area, which is pretty cool. Uh, if I felt more like it, I'd I'd consider this as a future base location. I just jamming off, jamming two ends, and then eventually like draining all of the water. But that seems kind of a pain in the ass, pain in the arse, if you will. Uh, this is desert. Not my not my ideal base location. But also, not the worst base location ever, if you don't mind husks instead of regular zombies. Checking that my white bed is up there. They safe and sound. Still way in high area. No, no, just regular land. Uh, afraid so. Let's keep journeying further afield. This is going to be a bit of a pain in the butt to travel to and from. Okay, spawn is going to be a bit of a pain in the butt to travel to and from. Uh, but I mean, if I build everything, everything I need in, in basically within reach of like one area, I should be should be kind of okay. Build farms in spawn is going to be crazy difficult, though. It's going to be crazy, crazy difficult. Because this is, I don't know if you guys, but it's not like flattened out area. This, this is literally just fucking <laughs> dead space. It's 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 like it's it's like natural terrain, not dead. Whereas our current spawn on Tales of Kalisha is completely dead space. There's a, it is about as dead as space gets. Let's be real. Uh. Gents, we might need to hunt down more, more bear treasure, even though we already have like two bear treasures, right? Wait, hold on, did I? Oh my god, oh my god, I have a buried treasure map that, it, that, that I not used. Oh, that's embarrassing. Uh, what about this one? This one's, this one's fine, we can throw that one away. But uh, yeah, eventually we're gonna have to do like a pirate episode where we go, 
Well, we put our language to pirate speak and we go hunt down all of the... All of the artifacts. Wow. Hold on. Okay, this goes up there. Oh, grab that. Grab this. Just the potatoes up here for a moment. Use that for what it's useful for. And... Is there anything else in there, by the way? Yeah, that's potatoes. Okay, let's very quickly see what here can replace. Paper is replaceable. Yeah, sugar cane. Bubble. Mutt. Suits. Infinitely replaceable. Uh, fire charge can go since we have flint steel. Run flesh. Seeds. The seeds might have actually been useful, but we will probably end up somewhere to make seeds. Uh, and the crops, the uh, well, mainly these these two are super useful because uh, they can't be got anywhere. Uh, kelp, also useful. Bamboo, oak, smithing template, hay bale, just for the amount. Uh, yeah, those should be obviously like a super need. Uh, and if and if some some change some change happens, we can always find the other stuff. Oh, okay. That's a buried treasure map. And fortunately, it's a buried treasure map. We're quite close to. You know what? Let's, let's take the map. Let's take the empty map. Just, just to make planting them eventually easier, I'm going to take that. And I know that leather, that leather chest plate was better than mine, but this leather chest plate is already not long for this world. So uh, it's gonna be gone soon. And let's put the buried treasure map that is further away from us. Let's let's put it there. So we are currently not far enough north. So we need to head further north, and then we also need to head a little bit further west, northwest. Or this looks be. Like, like, mostly ocean and then one island. I really hope if those Mushu Island would be friggin' amazing if, if this destined, if this buried treasure map just led me straight to my destiny. Oh, nope, it's land. It's land, and that is on the verge of a lake, I think. Let's, let's, let's discover more. Huh. Hmm. Our boat's at 25... You know what, hold on, let me just... Boat is at 2586 space 67 space negative 40 45. There we go. And that should be that. Unless I disconnect. At which point, whoops. At which point there goes there goes everything in the in the boat. But we can we can probably survive with the stuff we have on our backs. You know. Probably. a house by this point. It's like the day of Minecraft, they usually have to live. Not me. Never me. Oh, wait, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. It that way. It that way. Right that way. You know what, if I find a mansion just out of like randomness, like if I just randomly run into a woodland mansion, I might also steal that and make it a base. Because that qualifies for, you know, solid and also kind of defensibility just on 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 sheer size alone it is a defensible position 
trash object. Just because it's fucking big. Face no. Until I just have like a pixel of my butt sticking out. F3. Go to block 99. Nine. Okay, there you go. There we go. All the iron, heart of the sea, emeralds, and I might as well take this sword. Pretty cool they get. I didn't know. Didn't know they don't. Didn't know they had swords. But it's pretty cool that I just pulled a sword out of like ancient treasure. It's like it's like goldy. It's like it's, it's like a pirate. Like a pirate buried a cool sword that I have now found. All right, let's head back to my stuff. Hello, turtle. Okay, I should be all the way back. What here? Can't remember where specifically at the boat. This is um. Why is why is my why is my game stuck? Why is my why is my thing stuck in mining mode? That's very weird. Also, is that? So I saw that that thing and I was like, is that the Arch Ocean Monument? Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Okay. So twenty five eighty six. So that direction. Oh wait, that's 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 my boat. That's my boat. That's my boat. And then, oh my god, ruin another pot. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Crazy bad loot is what this place has. Jesus, Jesus, hell, Jesus, heck. Oh, sorry, I just realized that I have more than enough stuff to, uh, upgrade my chest plate. Upgrade my chest plate to a, you know, proper chest plate, but, you know, to an iron one. But this, this is a, a, not a huge concern at the moment. Also, I think that one was the one we looted, right? Yeah. Should, should be the one we looted. What is... Okay, that's not a moose island. This is, however, one of the new... Trillions, I believe. It's not tremendous. So I'm not gonna make like a, not gonna make like a note of it. If, if in our travels and we have an archaeology brush, maybe, maybe I'll do something with it. At the moment, pass. I'll just pass on that. And the hunt for a mushroom island continues. Oh, sunflower plains. This one's at least a pretty cool biome. Pretty cool very pretty meh biome. Paddle over here, put this shit down, take a nap. Take a quick nap, nice quick nap. Quick nap done, let's get in, let's get out.
Uh, let's keep. I guess let's just keep, keep being east. Thanks. Uh. It might kind of make sense to stop the video and then. Or to stop the shroom. And then hunt down a, hunt down a, bio, sorry, hunt, hunt down a mushroom island biome. Since we have kind of. Since we've kind of, kind of. What the main thing we wanted, which was bamboo. This bamboo, these three pieces of bamboo are eventually going to turn into farms that get us like 10,000 bamboo an hour. But. The in the interim, in the interim, let's uh, our secondary goal is finding a bamboo location, a bamboo play, if you will. Sorry, did I say a bamboo place? I, what I what I meant was finding a mushroom. Uh. Okay, so there is there's a tool that lets you view like the the map of a seed, but I don't want to like cheat every time. I don't every time I feel like I'm encountering a little tiny bit of resistance to just like oh here's the closest mushroom biome to me. I want to use this okay command. So it's only an hour thirty three minutes. The stream has been running for one hour thirty four minutes and two seconds. We're going to I'm not, I'm not in the pink of health, but if we can't find anything before 3, or if we can't find anything at the 3 hour mark... Oh wow, this this is actually kind of a cool little cove. Oh, you could have a secret docking area. And you can't find anything more. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, we can't find anything before three. Well, we'll we'll use the seed map tool. Uh, only highlight biomes so that we can't see a single structure, and then we will just just look for look for a seed using that. Wait, hold on. Is this this is a trail in? I think. Generated. Can't tell. I think this might just be weird generation. Weird will gen. Yeah, potentially weird will gen. Anyways, oh uh, yes, that's the that's the hard deadline. This is this is just gonna take me through like Ocean River and uh, no, this is just gonna take me through like a river travel, and then the river is going to hit like a like a big lake. And then I'm gonna travel around the lake, and I'm gonna realize this was one big waste of time. We we traveled, we traveled an extra thousand something blocks further than we needed to. Also, speaking of, how many blocks have we traveled by boat? Distance by boat, thirty kilometers, which is the highest distance walked on water. Wait, we should not have should not have that stat yet. Distance walked. 580 meters distance by boat 15 kilometers that's 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 very us i guess oh, wait, wait, hold, do we have bones do we have any bones no bones no bones about it no bones about us that's unfortunate but we oh wait, we can get a wolf some other time also i don't know if i don't know if a wolf can keep up teleporting while this boat is going full speed Yep, what did I say? Big, big lake. Oh no, actually, my bad, I was wrong. So I get open up in ocean. An inland ocean. Big lake. I still says river. Keep forgetting that, I keep forgetting that 118 made it was fucking enormous. If we, there, there are now rivers that are like small inland seas. Oh, oh, oh. Hit the end of the road? No, I don't think we've hit the end of the road. Yep, 
Yep, I don't think I don't think we hit the end of the road yet. I see. It almost looked like we did, but we didn't. Um. I wish cartographers sold like like you know how cartographers sell map structures. Like, hey, this is how you get to a this is how you get to a ocean monument. This is how you get to a. Uh, Woodland Mansion. I wish they did something vaguely similar where they sold us the coordinates too. Like a... I guess like a brand new biome. A biome that you've never discovered before. Or like, they sell you a random biome map, and then you click it and it becomes one of the 54, 54 biomes? Hold on. One of the 53 biomes, my bad, it's 53, not 54. Hmm. I'm kind of tempted to just like put put down like a temporary shack on island somewhere. And, and just a place like respite. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, wow. Has this hot offense no village? You know what? I'm just gonna call this the respite. Use the bed. Steal the food. Hello, cartographer. I'm stealing your maps because these are. Always something useful to have, and they're kind of, kind of hanging out to myself. Uh, good day, good day. Hello, armorer. Can I potentially. You know what? Hold on. Are you. Oh, you're the armorer. Hold on. Let me move this. Uh. No, I might. I might spend a little bit of time in this village just trading shit. Uh. Yeah, I might, I, just, I might just take a little intermission to, to trade until we've got, like, diamond level gear, maybe diamond gear? If we have diamond gear, we can... Oh, you know what, let me just steal, steal this. Steal, do a little bit of theft. We do a little bit of... Do a little bit of theft. Theft. You know, a little bit of theft. I don't, I don't know why I said the word theft like that so many times, but I think it's funnier if I keep butchering it. Fifth. And sand can be grabbed anywhere. Flint, kind of useful if I ever need to make a fletching table, which I might need to if this village does not have an organic fletcher. Sorry, I'm taking I'm taking the supplies. You guys are probably going to need to last the winter, but this this is this is uh, I'm, I'm a human being and you are not. Imperium, so that's some Imperium bullshit. But yeah, ooh, actually, my guy, do you offer a wheat trade? You offer a wheat trade. That is supreme. Uh, I'm very sorry. I'm going to trade, I'm going to max out all of your wheat trades. Wait, come back, I'm going to max out your wheat trades again. I wish I have pumpkins to trade with you, that that would make would be a worthwhile investment. Is this a librarian house? Is this a... Is this just a big housing house, or is this... No, okay. It's just... Ooh. You know what? Apples shouldn't mean that many more, but they, 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 they're good food. And in the event that we, uh... That we get very terribly lost, they might, they might just come in clutch. Or that we get lost in a place that doesn't have a lot of food in it, I, I should say. Oh, 
I'm also gonna stack up in pies. Uh, no particular reason. I just I kind of want to unlock the rest of this guy's secret trades. And once you are, uh, do I really have to do this? Okay, that got me a lot of XP, but it's oh hey Siamese cat. Oh that's adorable. Uh, do you do the you do? He does not currently do the trade that I'm looking for, which is the trade where he will give me he will give me a bunch of uh golden carrots. I was gonna turn the remaining ooh no you're just a regular cartographer. Turn the remaining emeralds that I had into golden carrots, but that's uh. You know, just just more more food for the journey, but that's I guess not the not really my best course of action. There, that's what we can do. Uh, yeah, and at the moment, one of the best things we can do is just keep on moving, keep on moving. The Maybe, maybe hope that night doesn't fall soon, and then that these people will stay alive. These villagers will stay alive for a little bit longer, you know. That's a sparse tundra. Now, I don't, I don't usually do this. I don't usually travel inland when I'm trying to stay, you know, in a boat. But sparse tundras usually lead to big mountain areas, and you know how I feel about mountains. This is kind of one of the and. We're already about, uh, let's see, Pythagoras, we're about 6,000 blocks out. Give, give it. It'll take a little bit. I'm terrible at math. But, we might have found a nice nice place to build this little snowy kingdom. A little sningdom, if you will. I don't like the word sningdom. It sounds like, sounds like a racial slur. It sounds like a racial slur for a group of people that hasn't exist. That like doesn't exist. Yeah. Snowy Kingdom is fine. Though. Snow is perfectly fine to say, I think. Uh, Snowdom. Uh, Snowdom and Gumball. Snowdom and Snow. Um, and these aren't all that high off the ground. Did I bring my bed with me? Yep. Okay. I'm gonna it so that I don't actually sleep in the bed and. And up, and then run off, thinking it's thinking the bed is a pile of snow. You know, I've traveled. We've traveled far enough by boat. We can afford to just travel a little bit by foot. Uh, oh, Arctic fox run by very quickly. Arctic fox going at incredibly higs higs high. Speed, higgle speed. The golden carrots are gonna run out soon, but I have I have a hope that before they do, all of this land, which is is eventually going to turn up into a mountain range, kind of like that, but maybe like a little bit taller, a little bit taller, a little, little bit taller, quite a bit taller. This ravine, I don't want to run into it back to the little, little, little bit taller than that. Little gonna need gonna need a gonna need something maybe a lot taller and a lot broader as well. Because I don't want I don't want to have like a skinny little tower castle. Although actually, you know what? If the tower has enough character, if we can make the tower have enough character. It would be kind of cool. Very hard, hard to park. Very good at it. Not a park monster. Our computer performs terribly. It's, it's this, this is this is not a long term viewer. This is not enough. About forty blocks off the ground, which is good. I guess it's it's defensible. Anything that tries to attack this area is going to have a real pain in the ass. It's going to be a real pain in the ass, but. Hold on. I'm also gonna write bracket boat here next to the respite village tag because we are. I 
do I do believe that I left my boat there. My boat that has all my stuff in it. So yeah, before before I do that, let me just very quickly make a shield. Oh, that goes in my offhand. Not a lot we can do with those iron nuggets, but I can make a chest plate. Which I have with this leather tunic. And did I did I make diamond boat? I don't think I did. Okay. Oh yeah, make boat. Break the chest plate. Break the crafting table, sorry. Uh get rid of three gold three gold nuggets probably won't do us that probably won't benefit us that much in the uh, yeah, here's to hoping. Just hoping we're not like three gold, three gold nuggets short something, and then we're like, ah, goddamn! If we just kept kept it in our inventory, you know. I'm not gonna bother picking up crops that I see because uh, there's actually I actually saw. Oh wait, mountains, tall mountains. Tall, big mountains, big tall mountains. Even uh, I feel like I feel like picking like a really tall mountain as a base is a good idea until you. you ooh, wait, hold on. Oh, that is actually very intriguing. That's very intriguing aesthetically. Uh, it's, it's, very, it's very good place to ice until you decide until you decide to dig like a quarry. You dig straight into an ancient and you're just like, ah, uh, that's. I keep forgetting those uh, thing now. And then you have to deal with a bunch of enemies that are like 50 times stronger than anything you've ever encountered. Like, legit, I would rather face 50 zombies attacking a village than one warden. <laughs> I just need- you just need to kite the zombies around until daybreak. Uh, don't- don't- don't even get me started on what the fuck you're gonna do to a warden. The guy with no one kill, can kill 50 zombies. Uh, 50 zombies in a village, you just aggro a bunch of them, kite them until bricks, and then... And then, you know, you're, you're, you're Gucci. What is this? It's 1, 120. Oh, this... Oh, wait, no, it gets taller, it gets taller, the mountain gets taller. Goes up to about, I'm assuming this is 130 something. 135, correct, and it's still taller still, it gets still, hold on, uh, how am I going to cross that distance, oh, you know what, actually I might just be able to, keep forgetting, you know, keep, keep forgetting, there's, there's an order of, there's the, there's an order of doing things. There's a there's a way there's a way we do things in this game. Uh, oh wow, that's a very nice plains. Huh? Could also do something with that. But what is what is the height at the peak? How high is it at the top? One fifty one. You know what? One fifty actually works out. For Home. Yeah, let's 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 call it home base alpha. Why not? That's a trend. Four 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 seven slash one fifty one slash negative fifty three eighty eight. There we go. We have home. We now have a home, gentlemen. This may, it may have taken us a little while. Uh, may have taken us a lot of while actually. But we we now have a place to live. Huzzah! So, first things first is probably taking this, making a pair of chests, bam, bam, putting down a white bed, bam, respawn point set, put all of this shit up here, all of it thrown right up here. Okay, all of the, all of the newbie tools, they can go up there as well, except we'll do do one, we'll do two, 
three, four. Keep our shield on us, and we are okay. First, first off, we need to we need to get all of our stuff. This is a uh, rather important. It's actually incredibly important that we get all our shit, and our shit is back at. Oh, basically the same coordinates, but about 1,300 blocks that way. Oh, great. Uh, well, it's a good thing so much of the world seems to be connected by rivers, because there's a river that goes that way. And from that river... This is really happening. This is really happening to me. Okay. From that river, we should be able to have a nice, clean entry that will take us quite a big distance. Please don't be a 39 fall. If it's if it's exactly for some reason, if it's exactly 39 blocks, boat falls will kill you, or boat bo boat falls will do damage to you. I found this out. I found this out the hard way when I was researching like why why I died in that other hollow hardcore in that other hollow hardcore you know okay first things first let's let's travel a little bit down this river delta and just that the other mountain is not taller than our mountain because I don't want to be you know on one mountain looking up I want to be on I want to be on top of the world looking down oh oh shit that is kind of a tall mountain and not not, okay, ours is kind of tall, like, like, kind of tall. This is tall, well, this one's shorter than us, but it's broad. And the broad might be, or the fact that it's broad might be better for the broad. Sorry, the fact that it's broad might actually be like a build. Also, I don't know why I'm doing this basic bitch Minecraft thing and building a castle. But, uh, I can't, can't deny I like castles. Oh my god. Hold on. Hold on, hold the friggin' phone. I'll take these burning things, so take... You know what? Actually, actually, actually... This might be a better castle. This might be a better, ca better castle, because it's way more scenic, right? And... It's, it's friggin' huge. Uh, I did not bring... Food. I did not bring food on this adventure like some kind of imbecile. You know, let's climb to the top of this one. And then, when down, we will see if this is a good base location. Okay, that's uh. No, just get a quick F3 reading. This is not as tall. Not as tall as ours. Ours is about 40 blocks taller. Wait, no. Okay, so that that is high up. That is high up. But this, if just head in this direction, this could be a little bit taller potentially. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, this is only woody. Okay, it's nowhere near tall, right? But we'll call this home bracket actual because I have decided that this spot is the better one. Three nine five two slash one three zero slash minus v four seventy five. This is going to be living by you guys mask because the view like straight down looks insane i'm gonna have to terraform this river a little bit i'm gonna have to shape it up so that like this river merges there and like they they both go into there and then they flow direction you know in a in a semi like normal way with us with a bit more normalcy i guess there's a as hills full of resources hills full of resources over there this feels like a a good place. And 
We can we can also do something with that surrounding hill, with that hill across. We can level out the plains biome a little bit. We can almost anything. Also, there's donkeys, which are going to be useful if we can't find camels. I think camels have more storage than donkeys, but I'm not 100% on that. You would need to get someone who knows more than I do, and. and You'd need, you'd need to get someone who like who like read the update patch notes and has been consistently keeping up with them. Okay, so let me just run my ass back there. Also, kind of a big boon, kind of a tremendous boon actually. Cows, cows, cows are like the the goat livestock mob to keep because leather, cooked beef, they go crazy. I'm I'm going to have to start running. I'm gonna have to start fucking running. I'm gonna have to do cardio. Don't worry though. There's a boat right here. I left it in a good place. Swim, swim, swim. Dodge the fucking useless creatures. Go F5. And our next goal is to basically go to Espit Village or 4400. Oh, whoops! I've already missed it by a little. Uh oh, uh oh. Basically, we go to 4400, and from 4400 we go, we go to 4200 uh, on the on the other axis. Jesus, this this is this is explaining this while is not not doing me much good, not making me not making me look very intelligent. Okay. Let's let's just start moving. Let's just start moving. There's no two ways about it. We we're gonna have to we're gonna have to keep going until we hit the uh, cold cold biome. Run across the cold biome as hard as we can. The cardio session we're gonna be big. Zombies don't want anything to do with them. And we have, actually, we have kind of a handy road. Let's, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. No. 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 Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, wait. I found a place I can rest for the night. I think. Excuse me. Uh, uh, like not doing that. Like here. You mind like. Just a lot of my health. Uh, please tell me. Whew. Please tell me this is one of those with the cool under. under nope, no cool underneath. Oh, that's that's unfortunate. Still, I am going to steal the furnace because I'm a little criminal, and then I'm going to steal this. And then, you know what? I like I like red beds, so I might as well take one of those. Those red beds fit right at right at a castle aesthetic. So, you know, I I'm trying to I'm trying to like like talk out of sounding like a fucking criminal when it is exactly what I am. Uh, okay, we are too hungry to walk. Oh, we are too hungry to run. As unfortunate. If I see a zombie burning alive, I'm gonna, you know, get get a little forbidden snack, forbidden snacky pack. You got, I I don't know if everyone anyone here has eaten a tuna snacky pack, but this is it's this thing sold in Singapore, specifically Singaporean supermarkets, and it's it's good. It's good in the sense that it's like edible, but it is also some of the most Warhammer 40k food I can physically fucking find. It is. They say it's tuna. Okay, but uh, you peel. You, sorry, they say it's tuna or salmon because they they sell these in multiple types of multiple fish types, right? You open the package, you look inside, and you can tell in your very soul, in your very human soul, that that uh, that is a fucking polar bear. That is a fucking polar bear. I want nothing to do with a polar bear. But you can tell. You can tell in your human soul that that is not tuna. Look at it. You sniff it. You're like, that's not tuna. It's not salmon. You call it tuna. You say, you say tuna. You say salmon. 
I don't think you really know what that means. I don't think you really know what tuna and salmon are. But, uh... But yeah, it's... it's Tuna snacky packs, you should try some, uh, if, if you are ever... If anyone's ever in Singapore, I, I guess they're probably sold in other places. You should, you should consider a tuna snacky pack. It's a... It is a not terrible thing to eat. I mean, it's not the greatest thing. It's probably not the best thing in the world for your health, but it's 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 serviceable food. And it's a long since when I uh, that being said, it's probably I'm probably gonna find out like 25 years down the line that oh, those things gave people like turbo ultra cancer. And it, and it weren't tuna. It was human beings. This 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 was like this was like well, we were. It really was cop starch from 40k. But yeah, that's the, that's oh, not 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 the best food imaginable. I okay, we're going to eat We're going to turn everything. But there's not a lot. Actually, there's a couple. There's a little bit I can eat here. Let's take a. Wheat. I make a bunch of that wheat into bread, breadable bread. Okay, and let's very quickly see what we can take. I think we can fit almost all of this into my inventory. Uh, so I'm going to hold on. Show craft. Hey, hey, now I'm going to take these things. And I'm going to find the boat. If you can, if I'm going to leave the boat. Ah, thank you. Take the boat with me. I cannot. So let's ditch the let's ditch the standard oak boat. Let's grab this. Let's go to the village. Let's trade what I can. And what little I can trade holds. Like, wheat should be more useful as emeralds, especially since we got seeds on us. We can, we can go on a quest eventually. We can go questing, and then once we go questing, we'll, uh, uh, poop. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna eat some of the carrots. As long as we have one of each of them, we should be golden. We should be, we should be serviceable, is what I should say. Uh, kind of tempted to kill the golem, but at the same time, this village might be useful to me in future. It might be the closest civilization, so I might want to keep these people alive and well. Uh, you are not the guy. Uh, who is the who's the other? Oh, that's a lot. Oh, all right. I traded out a bunch of cookies. Uh, you, you are probably the guy with the higher level trades. Am I correct to say this, good sir? Yes, you are. Um, you know, in the meantime, while I wait for you to. Have your old trades restored? I might as well just put lily pads down here. I don't know why. I don't know why I'm helping you guys, like, at all, but... But yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. Anyways. Are you gonna res redeem your trades? If you're not gonna redeem your trades, I, uh... I don't- I don't really need anything to to you that you that you want. Okay, uh I guess maybe I just need to spend some time in the vicinity. Maybe. Should not have should, probably should not have done that because it broke my spawn point, but now I can probably navigate back back that way to my to my bases without without too much difficulty, I want to say. I can potentially do that. Did I take Take yeah, yeah the other the first. wait did I take both did I take both furnaces nope I might have left I might have left some things of value in the village which is ah yeah like that I was taking this I pinch that and I'm gonna pinch anything else you guys have that is of value um erm um, um, actually, um, actually, 
Nope. Nothing, nothing useful unless I want a bunch of beds for villager trading. You know what? I have an idea. Gentlemen, I might not have a brain, but I have an idea. Okay, so we turn all of that into gold. Uh, we take that. We take all but one golden carrot. Surround it like this. Replace. Make a bunch of golden carrots. Throw out Lily of the Valley. Take this. Put this in our hot bar. What are we going to get rid of? You know what? Seeds. Seeds are very ubiquitous. You can find them nearly anywhere. Seeds are probably the, the one thing that can afford to go. And, um... And, yeah. Now, let's see if our good friend, the villager, have freshed his trades. I keep I keep clicking on the wrong guy. Just just on on reflex. As Bowman is probably just like a lack of thought. No. Okay, if he hasn't refreshed his trades, forget about him. We'll we'll head back. We will head back to new home base. Okay, put it put all our stuff down, and then we will move stuff from home base alpha to home actual or new new home base. And then we'll figure some shit out. We'll 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 we'll, we'll make something work. Yeah, we'll make something work. Don't worry. We always do. that we can I guess just get return return to our travels you know return return to our adventures well, actually no at this point we stop our adventures we start this is the point where we start building stuff or we start settling down get the polar bear angry try and avoid said angry polar bear I'm not I'm not around a polar bear on a, on a beach boat and they keep keep on keep on trucking Skep is playing Solaris, by the way. In case anyone was interested, what my good friend Skep is doing, he keeps he keeps booting up his his game. He's playing Stellaris and he keeps crashing. I have seen him open Stellaris like four times. So <laughs> I just I might just send him a Discord message that's like Stellaris these nuts Stellaris these nuts on your face. Stellaris my nuts on your chin. Oh my god, he's playing it again. Going to click on click on skep message Stellaris question mark Stellaris my nuts on your chin send Discord message. Yes, yeah, that's, that's that's gonna make him happy. <laughs> I still remember when he was playing Dota, and then I kept sending him like, "Dude, do these nuts make you feel good, Skep?" <laughs> okay, let's let's. 
Oh my god, he keeps fucking... <laughs> he's crashed, like the game has crashed and he's booted it up like three more times. Skip, there's got to skip, buddy. There's got to be a point where, you're like, yeah, I don't think, I don't think the, I don't think the game wants you to play it today. You know what, though, I, I admire, I admire his determination. At the very least, I admire, I admire his, his, his scapacity. His sh capacity. This message. What do you say? Hollow heart? More like hollow anus. You are already. You already know. You already know. Do I have any. Bamboo. I can plant bamboo. I can bamboo up there. I can turn the pieces of bamboo into a... I can turn the two pieces of bamboo into a remaining six. I can place four torches, and then I basically... This basically becomes... For, for, for until we have a bamboo farm up and running, this is gonna become Bamboo Farming Simulator. This is gonna become Minecraft Bamboo Farming Simulator. That's, that's literally what this is all gonna be. I'm not, not even kidding, by the way. This... <laughs> This is going to be a farming sim where we only grow bamboo, and and I chop it down with this with this pirate sword, this epic pirate cutlass I I've I've acquired. Oh, a skelly skeleton. There we go. Oh, actually, you know what? Hold on. This is going to be useful if I plant one of this here, then I get rid of this, get rid of this, and then take the bone, and then I do, and then I break this, and then I collect this, and then yeah, this, 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 this. You ever say a word so much it starts to lose the meaning in your head? That's this. Okay, so I'm back up here. Let me take these three sticks. Let me craft torches. And let me just start planting torches around. Ooh, whoops. That skeleton sees me. Okay. Fortunately. You are made of the shit that I need to make my pet bamboo grow. I'm having six frames a second. In case, in case anyone was wondering, like, what, what, what? How's your, how's your computer holding up? It is not. Thank you for asking, but it is not. Hold on, let me just very quickly plant all of these torches, which is my favorite Foster the People album. And once all those torches are planted, we can pick up that bone, which was left, like, here. Okay. Break the bamboo. Place the bamboo. We'll basically build like a like a protective wall out of bamboo. Just 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 for starters, I guess. I dropped I dropped seeds so I could pick up the bamboo. That's uh Alright, let's put down both of the crafting tables I have because I'm a psychopath. Uh, I heard I heard a child screaming outside my house, like like a child screaming like they're being killed, and I was like, what the fuck was that? Is that a phantom? I should I should have been sleeping on time, and then I was like, oh wait, no, that's, that's just 
children screaming. Which is it's not not a kind of kind of a weird thing to be used to, but also I'm 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 kind of unperturbed by most most things in this world. So you know, child screaming, eh. Children scream. What do you do? What can what can what can a man do? Okay, so I need to get a I need to get back to where my stuff was before. Grab it, bring it back this way, and then I think the I think the episode can end for today. Oh. Skip sent me a message. Let me just kill the spider first. No? Nothing? Okay. That's uh, that's depressing. Really? Two of You know, whatever. It's it's whatever. It's W slash E. It's W A. It's we. I'm gonna make my way back down. Cross there. Cross that again. Uh, walk across. A lot of, lot of crossing. Oh, I guess, I guess Skep did not send me a message. Oh well. Open, open this up. You know what? I'm not gonna kill these chickens. Uh, you know what? Actually, hold on. I'm not gonna kill these chickens. I'm going to put them in a hole. Oh, chicken hole. And in chicken hole, they are going to have... They are going to have lots of chicken babies. Yeah, come on, come on. Down the hole, down the hole. Jump in. Water's fine. You're gonna go in there, and you are gonna go in there. And then next time I, I want eggs. Or oh, next time I... Shit, I think I didn't breed them. Next time, uh... Well, the next time eggs are required for something, I'll, uh... Oh, hey, first thing I've bred. Okay, that's chicken hole, by the way. Uh, next time I need... Okay, basically, chicken farm... Chicken farm might be one of my early food resources. Bef even before cow farm. Even before cow farm, I might go chicken farm. Also, wow, that mountain is... That mountain... Actually, kind of cool. I know that point is, like, super high. But, uh... Mountain range is actually quite tall. I, uh... I might regret actually picking... Picking the that that mountain as my new base, but... You know what? Honestly, there's, there's nothing saying I can't have two bases that are close to each other. You know, just have, like, a primary base, secondary base. And once I have Elytra, it's, it's, it's going to be like one firework rocket to get between both of them. And once I have an Elytra, we'll probably have an Elytra farm. So, oh, oh a firework rocket farm. My only grievance is that these are both going to be really fucking hard to, cr to carve an organic looking staircase into. This is going to be difficult, 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 lemon difficult. I wonder where my items are. I think they might be at the top. Picking which exact things to take, but all of these tools have all of these tools should have sentimental value uh, or use at some point in the future. And you know what? Flint can be grabbed anywhere. The maps should be useful. Uh, and I'm going to pick the flint steel that has more durability over the one that has less. So yeah, this is a. Uh, 
I like how both of the both of the base candidates have a really good have a really good overlook of the um of the land below them. Uh but yeah, this one this the the other one's probably the one I'm gonna base at. Alternatively, you know, I, I, I get a I get a lot of stone. I get a shitload of stone, and I make a mountain that connects the two of them. I literally connect two mountain ranges to each other. <laughs> and uh that's 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 some that's some like psychotic that's that's some hermitcraft level world terrain editing. But I mean it's it's not not one hundred not completely beyond my reach. Tell you what, if 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 this if this goes on for like a hundred episodes and I still can't decide which which place I want to base at, if I just gather a bunch of stuff, defeat the Ender Dragon, defeat the Wither, build like a mega quarry, and I still can't pick which of the two places I want to live at, let's just let's just live at both. Let's just connect the two mountains, and and be done with it. Wait, see more? Okay, more bones, always good. Grow a lot of bamboo, that's part of our wood concern taken care of. Let's put these down. Before I end the episode, I might actually just I might actually just bring up an infinite water source from down 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 in the river. I might just bring up one infinite water source, uh, use that water source to make a tiny farm up here. That might be Oh, hello. Timon J's original says dot dot dot. Well dot 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 to you, my guy. Uh I'll take all this. All this shit up here, and I think we can. Uh, you know what? We can maybe afford the resources to make an iron hoe. This one's this one's not gonna this one's not gonna last forever, anyways. So, build this. Let's. Uh, oh, you know what? We might have a handy water source like right down here. So, oh, you know what? It's, it's right over here. That's convenient. One, hop up, hop up here. Uh, I can, I can. Damn, what a mic! But it's close to my mouth. Oh, uh, that's that's just the grainy quality of this mic. It's. I don't know if you. I don't know if you've used the Onikuma K9 before. It, that that's that's the model of this mic. But it's. It is. It is crispy, and this mic is also all this shit. It's uh. It's. It was. <laughs> It was, huh? Actually, when when was this a purchase from? I want.
want to say that I got this in 2017, so five, six years old. Kind of, kind of an old mouse. Anyways, let me, let me just begin setting up a plot of, a farming plot. Nah. Oh, okay. Sweet. Anyways, let's break this. Break this. And I think we'll, 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 okay, so we'll have an outline, just like a, like an outline so we can fence it in, maybe. Right, so this is, this is going to be where we put, I guess, cobblestone or some other border separating block, whatever the fuck we'll call it. And then we'll do one, two, three, four. This is the block that the water source will go in. And then we'll do one, two, three, four. Oh wait, that, that block should stay intact. What we should do is get rid of this. Break these. Break these all until they connect up to each other. And uh, pff, yeah, with okay, hold on. I should I should probably sleep the night. Should probably probably get a good night's sleep before we do anything silly that gets us that gets us blown up by a creeper. You know, I can just dig two by two blocks and build and like make an infinite water source. I can. Uh, I can, but I mean, I'm not going to. It's a uh, where is okay? Where are the crops we want planted? We have four seeds. We have a single carrot. We have twenty-five potatoes. Okay, that might be enough to fill a crop plot. I guess I guess we could do more, but uh, yeah, let's go grab this. Uh, we're gonna have more seeds when we finish clearing out this plot. You know, we might as well grab the dirt since we're at the stage of the game where everything we have is valuable. Everything we can get our hands on is valuable. So, let's go. Let's go out four. Let's go out four. Four. And four. And this should be the limit of what a single block of water can hydrate. And then from there we can start merging crop plots by putting them side to side. And that this is this is the start of what I like to call passive income. Uh, we just sit here passively and we and we grow shit out of the ground. It's, it's a ancient Mesopotamian secret. So we're gonna put carrots in that corner. The potatoes will spiral out of this corner, and we'll probably put the wheat there. Oh, that is apparently wheat's the only one that gives you a seedy place. Which is weird, I know. I feel like, I feel like, how much, how many girlfriends do I have in my life? Zero. Which is kind of the optimal number. I feel like more than one is, more than one is cause for, cause for concern. You are inviting, you are inviting some trouble into your life that you might not be ready to deal with. Yeah. Yeah, you, you really might not be ready to deal with multiple GFs. Anyways, I have a water breathing pot. Which is, I'm not. I'm not gonna go swimming. I just wanna. I just want a bottle, so that I can turn some of this into mud, and then using that mud. Uh, wait a second. I I forgot. I forgot the order of things. There we go. Mud, 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 mud. Break these. And I believe they can become packed mud if we take a bit of hay, so wheat, put the wheat there, combine it, we will have packed mud, and then we can make a kind of convincing slab, which is... Okay. Uh, can you make slabs out of packed mud, is a question I should have asked. Okay, there we go. Mud brick slab. There's a block that fits in kind of normally. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't have the, uh, I don't have the wood to make a composter. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab a shitload of bamboo because you can do that in the 1.20 update. Turn said bamboo into a bamboo wood. Bamboo wood the, 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 the block. 
And then once we do that, I should be able to make a composter, I think. Should be able to afford one at the very least. And I guess my goal for the next episode is dig down to the redstone level. Uh, take, take a bunch of redstone. And then... Oh, whoops. Take a bunch of redstone and then use that redstone to make pistons and shit. Because pistons are something we kind of, kind of, kind of need. Kind of need a lot. Also, do I, do I have any more coal? Yeah, okay, just enough. Just need enough to make like this. And yeah. So what I will do is we will first drop a mud brick slab here. Oh, great. Flub that. Uh, put this potato here. I'll put a mud brick slab here. Torch here so that the light goes as far as it can. And then we'll have a composter so that if there's anything we don't need, like azure bluettes, we can just compost them. Get the bone meal. Take said bone meal. Put it on a carrot. And continue the cycle effectively. I'm also going to put two corn flour in there. Oh, wait. Is that the sound of a composter being filled? Yep. Okay, so now we can start working on getting a slightly more equal number of carrots, and I think now is probably a good time to end the episode, because this is probably the start of like when it gets boring. This is probably just going to be me like sitting here waiting for a bunch of bamboo to grow. Once a bit of bamboo grows, we just break, sorry, take sword, break the bamboo, craft sticks, take sticks to crafting table, put in crafting table. I can apparently make a chiseled bookshelf. That's cool, I guess. I don't know what the fuck I'm going to put in it, but uh, it's uh, like, like all these books that I don't have. Oh wait, no, actually I do have a couple books. Is there a way for me to... Okay, so it fits, fits six books, I guess. That's 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 what I've learned, and what what it'll basically be is I will find a spot like I don't know like here, yeah fuck it here I'll dig I'll dig I'll dig a two block wide hole all the way to all the way to redstone level or not even redstone level just just like diamond level in general, and then oh but actually you know what that might be that might be kind of important to show off because it'll be my first mining adventure. Um. Okay, I'll tell you what. Okay, the next time we stream, it'll be mining mining the deep slate level. But at the moment, what we're probably just going to do is, off-camera, we're going to be sitting in a hole, farming. Like, every time every time I think the farm's crops are ready, I'll come back out of the hole, and we will... You know, I'll, I'll literally sleep under my bed. I'll literally just AFK underneath my bed like some little gremlin. And we'll just... We'll just see if, if, um, we'll just come out every 20 minutes, mine everything that the farm has. When I was six years old, the most evil thing I did was build a Pepe in public server. Do you mean a pee, -pee? Like, do you mean like a dick, or do you mean like Pepe the frog? Because, ooh, hold on, bamboo mosaic, is that a cool block? Oh, you know what, this, this, I'm not gonna lie, this block is kinda hitting. I might, I might actually use bamboo mosaic in my builds. Anyways. Yeah, I might just might just hop off the server now, and next time you see me, we'll have a shitload of crops. We'll have hopefully a lot more crops. Maybe I'll make like three diverse crop plots, like one for each. One for yeah, I guess one for each crop is fair. One for each crop that's not beetroot. No, like dick, but I want to say it in a nice way. Okay, okay, yeah. So we'll have we'll we'll have one crop plot for every crop for every crop that is not beetroot. And then, I guess the next episode's gonna be the mining episode. So yeah, I'll see you guys in a bit. I'll see you guys in a while. Goodbye!